Well, new tonight, Aurora getting an economic boost, thanks in part to Congressman Jason Crow. He helped secure more than $12 million in congressional funding for community projects in his district. That includes $850,000 to support an educational partnership between the Community College of Aurora and Aurora Public Schools. Your reporter in Aurora, Kelly Worthman, shows us how that money is being put to work. It's been just about six months since construction started here at the Community College of Aurora campus. Now, thanks to a nice boost in funds, the school is another step closer to providing access not only to a higher education, but to jobs that are needed right now. Super excited about what this means for the college, super excited about what this means for the community. A new workforce training and education space is taking shape. So this is going to be a state-of-the-art facility, uh, over 50,000 square feet, Center for STEM, Power Mechanic, and Applied Technology. Breaking ground and breaking barriers, this new facility will merge the Community College of Aurora's campuses that are now miles apart, providing hands-on learning for college and Aurora high school students. What does it look like to create seamless opportunities for the students that are in the high schools uh, to be able to be trained uh, for workforce development opportunities uh, and to be able to close a gap for many families when it comes to transportation. From the fields of construction and mechanics to the ever-evolving world of technology, the training programs offer enhanced education and career connections. Over 55% of our students are first generation. So many of the jobs that we're training these students for, there is not anyone in their family that has ever done this job before. Just ask Leslie Cordova. So some of the classes that I took like directly related to my job now that I have, so that was super helpful. She recently graduated and now works at the school in IT, saying the programs offered here changed her life. I think it says a lot about how education is like moving forward to like get these students employed that are in high school and get them the skills that they need for like the workforce. And the future STEM center is bound to benefit Aurora students for decades to come. The state has approved us to start a new nursing school uh, for fall of 2025. So this is going to be an opportunity of significant growth for Community College of Aurora. If all goes as planned, this new STEM center will be open in time for the 2025 school year. In Aurora, I'm Kelly Worthman covering Colorado First. Kelly, Michael Abeda, and Tori Mason are your reporters in Aurora. And if you have a story idea for them, send them an email through our website, cbscolorado.com. Well, we just wrapped